Paul, called to be an apostle of Jesus Christ through the will of God, and our brother Sustenus, to the assembly of God which is at Corinth, those who are sanctified in Christ Jesus called saints, with all who call on the name of our Lord Jesus Christ in every place, both theirs and ours. Grace to you and peace from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. I always thank my God concerning you for the grace of God which was given you in Christ Jesus that in everything you were enriched in him in all speech and all knowledge even as testimony of Christ was confirmed in you so that you come behind in no gift, waiting for the revelation of our Lord Jesus Christ, who will also confirm you until the end, blameless in the day of our Lord Jesus Christ. God is faithful, through whom you were called into fellowship of his Son Jesus Christ, our Lord. Now I beg you, brothers, through the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, that you all speak the same thing, and that there be no divisions among you, but that you be perfected together in the same mind and in the same judgment. For it has been reported to me concerning you, my brothers, by those who are from Chloe's household, that there are contentions among you. Now, what I mean is this, that each of you says, I will follow Paul, I will follow Apollos, I follow Cephas, I follow Christ. Is Christ divided? Was Paul crucified for you? Or were you baptized in the name of Paul? I thank God that I baptized none of you except Crispus and Gaius, so that no one should say that I baptized you into my own name. I, I also baptized the household of Stephanus. Besides them, I don't know whether I baptized any other. For Christ sent me not to baptize, but to preach the good news, not in wisdom of words, so that the cross of Christ wouldn't be made void. For the word of the cross is foolishness to those who are dying, but to you who are being saved, it is the power of God.